Well, I'm sorry, guys. That was weird. I accidentally stopped. I accidentally stopped recording. I thought I just hit the pause button, but I accidentally hit stop. Either way, here's the other one. This could be a part two video. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna pull up the other one. Okay, guys. Now here's a question for you to ask. Okay, guys, be quiet. I've got to say that. Um, here's a question for you guys to ask. Um, here's um, I mean, which logo was was the weirdest out of those three? The next one is the Jack in the Box logo. This may seem weird because because why the heck are the wires connected? It's like a freaking half visible X over here. And it kind of looks like the Jesus symbol. Why well, I also think it looks like a fish. But also, there's another hidden message. Can you find that's I mean that's it that's in the word box as well. Can you see it guys? Can you see it? Well that's correct. It's a bunny. Why the heck do they have a bunny and a logo? That is weird, because Jack in the Box has nothing to do with bunnies. Yeah, going off that chaos, it's also in the word Jack as well. Um, and in the word Duh, uh, there's, um, it's, boy, it's like someone um, has their arms up and um, at when eating at table. Uh, either way, no table shaped like a letter F. Which is, which is why this logo is just pretty weird. Let's move on to the next one. Well, guys, we're not done yet. There's still more. Well, one of those left is the UNC TV logo from, from 79 until until um, the early 80s. Of course, this at least this logo is short-lived because this is a PBS logo. Well, this is one of the weirdest. Just look at where Z. Again, just like in a Kowalski Zippo logo, it looks like Pac-Man. Except this time, it looks like there's two of them. And to where you looks like a where A with its um, outline unfinished. Um, and letter N looks like it's copy-pasted from you. Again, why are the letters stuck together again? Either way, why are the letter T's backwards? And they also look more like... JV written in a different style. Next one is the 2001 Nick Jr. on CBS logo. This is pretty weird. I never seen the CBS logo in green before. Pretty weird. And also, that looks nothing like Nick Jr. logo. It's like it's like Nick is just helping. It's just helping Junior like he is. Like he's about to fall off that that CBS as if it were a bounty ball. This may seem pretty weird, but this but this logo is just but this logo is just um this just fit good with the early two thousands. That's for sure. Also, guys, um, it's two thousand and two, um, and and of course um. And of course, this weird logo still keeps on going on with Viacom's chaos and and creating Nick um, logos in collaboration with CBS, which is pretty weird because because just look at this one. Speaking of the weird logo, they made they make weird they made weird items for it. And this is just very weird. At least, at least CBS is not green because that made the Nick Jr. one look very ugly. Okay, guys, and there's also there's also um this weird clip of it on YouTube that I watched before. And it was like very weird. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. There's two more. Well, this is the second to last one. It's the 1989 to 1998 Armin logo. And this is weird. Um, at a time when Wallace and Gromit was popular, they just used this weird logo. 
Except it's pretty weird. Oh yeah. And the animation of the logo itself is pretty weird. Now so what the heck? Why I mean like yeah, only if only if they uh only if a picture this picture of someone wearing in a purple shirt wearing a tie missing his eyes was the best logo they could come up with. The 1998 logo always took better effort than this. And this and the scare fact for this one is like probably low to high. Okay guys, now let's move on to the last one. Okay guys, we've saved the weirds for last. The Armin 1993 print logo. Many people think there wasn't even more than one logo used at the time. Well, then you thought wrong. This logo was first found on rare tapes of Wallace and Gromit the wrong trousers. And this is and this may seem pretty weird. And someone said this it looks like an I um an ice cream with um with a lot of sheep coming out of it. Well I, well what I think it actually looks like is that is is the same freaking weird clay face we wearing a tie and smoking while looking out the window looking at stars. If that's what it's actually meant to be, this is just too inappropriate for Tron's ro for Tron's logo. If it's that. Well, hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to if you want to comment what logo you thought was the weirdest, comment, okay? So, so this is a part two because I'm sorry I accidentally stopped the video. I wanted this to be a part two video anyway. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. This will, um, our um, videos will be coming soon.